Hello viewers, welcome to AudioVis 360. Today I have this JBL Go Plus Bluetooth speaker for tear down. So let's tear this down. I will show you the steps how to tear this down and let's see what is there inside the speaker. So without wasting the time, let's start tearing this down. To tear this down, I have to take this metal grill here. So I have to pry this without damaging this rubber here, this point, this corner. We have to carefully, let's start trying this to pry out. So. Now I have this sharp tool here, just trying to pry this metal grill. So this is a bit hard here. Like this, you have to take out. So this is the metal grill taken out without damaging the housing. So there will be four screws, I think one, two, three and 4 so let's remove that so star plus screwdriver is required so let's remove so this is go plus actually so the size of this go plus is much bigger than jbl go for comparison i will show the jbl go size as well here now after removing this uh, screw so let me show you the comparison so I have this JBL go so you can see this is the height difference and the width is also smaller you can see this is bigger black one is bigger and the thickness is also the black one is bigger this is small so this is JBL go I have made teardown video of this JBL go you can just go through my, the playlist of audio is 360 now it's time to take out this speaker housing to take this speaker housing again I have to pry this out from this place so let's try prying here that's it without damaging the housing without damaging the housing here I have taken out this speaker case housing so this is the internal look of JBL go plus pretty solid build here so I will take this out as well and the speaker size is similar of JBL go I think there might be wattage difference in the speakers all right no problem so I will try to take out this mesh here so this is the driver there is one single mono driver let me show you the size of the driver here as well so the size of the driver is exactly one and a half inches 1.5 inches all right now this is the base port the air comes out from this the air pumps out from this hole and this small uh, thing is a LED indicator, transparent thing. This LED indicator, this emission of this light will pass through this transparent thing. Alright, now I am going to keep this separately. Now it's time to tear this down. Take out the motherboard here as well. Let's try it to take out. Now there are 1, 2, 3 screws here which I can see as of now. Let's take that out. So this is the third screw. Alright, now let me take out this junction and this is for mic I think. So both has been removed now. Let's try prying it. Yeah, it is coming out. Okay, this is as simple as that to tear this down. So this is the motherboard loop. So these are the five controls which turn on 
Bluetooth, volume minus, volume plus and play pause button. So these are the five micro switches and this is the LED indicator. This connection is for battery and this is the audio IC. We will try to come closer. If you want you can pass and read the number. Okay, like this. All right, now this is the Bluetooth module. This section is the Bluetooth module and this is the micro USB for charging of the speaker. This is the auxiliary input. All right, that's it in this section. And this small point, this thing is, I think this is for charging the speaker. Charging IC is there because this is the junction for connection of the battery. All right, now I will show the back side of the motherboard. There is nothing much. There is only testing points here and there are few components here. That's it for this motherboard. All right, now I am keeping this and let's see the battery specification here. The company is McNair. So this is the company which produces the battery. McNair produces the battery for JBL. And uh, there is some other company as well. I, I remember, I think that is Great Power. Great Power also the uh, company which manufactures manufacture the battery for JBL products like Bluetooth speakers. So let's see the specification here. McNair rechargeable lithium ion polymer battery. Model number is MLP284154. So rating is 3.7 volts, 730 mAh. So this is bit higher compared to JBL Go portable speaker. This is Go Plus. So the capacity of the battery is increased here. And made by McNair New Power Co Limited. That's it. Rest remaining thing is written in Chinese. So potential this this side you can see caution potential for fire or burning do not disassemble puncture crush heat or burn use only with specified charger so that's it with this battery i'm not going to take this out because this is pasted here there is no use of taking it because the specification is very clear here this has four connections here the right one is so one red color cable is there two yellow colors and one black so black and red will be positive and the center one will be for temperature and some other thing that is for reference it is used all right this is the housing empty housing of jbl go plus and this is the motherboard which i have taken out from this housing and this is the speaker case housing and the last one is the metal grill which covers the total speaker here now last thing i want to show you the speaker driver here as well there is only two screws so I, I will take this out and let's see so this is also plus screws two screws are there to hold the speaker to its place all right you can see this is the driver this is somewhat similar to jbl go bluetooth speakers driver but i think the specification will be different We'll try to remove this if it doesn't come out i will not force this to take out it's hard to take out so all right that's it this is the tear down i will put this back together assemble this back all right the first thing is motherboard so it's easy just you have to take this wire like this two cables mic and battery and we have to slightly insert here from like this you have to insert in a tilted angle like this and just by like this now it should go like this in a tilted angle it will go to its place very easily that's it it is placed perfectly now it's time to put this battery connection back to motherboard connected now i'm going to connect this mic so mic is connected battery is connected all right that's it it's time to we have to place this cable properly otherwise 
the screws will harm the cable like this now it's time to put this speaker back to its housing like this there are two screws i'm going to put here that's it now i am going to connect this speaker here so before connecting the speaker i forgot to put the screws three screws i have removed so i will put the screws back first so this is the first place and this is the second one the last and final third one here yeah. all right now screws has been placed i am placing this cable like this as i removed earlier now it's time to put back this speaker housing back to its place connecting the speaker wire and let's see where is the led led is here is the transparent thing and this is the led so just inserting like this done i'm almost done now it's time to put the four screws back so that's it four screws has gone to back back to its place so i'm just making this flat and simply let's see whether this is clean and clear so i'm just putting this mesh metal mesh back to its place just by pressing it will go back and it will hold strongly you can see it will not come out so that's it this is that you have done off jbl go plus all right thanks for watching the video if you like the video please do like share subscribe to audio vis 360 and hit that notification bell icon and write comment in the comment section below thanks for watching bye